best we won't make it to Calico like this. Move, Gravener! I order you not to let me die like that! I almost had her. If it weren't for that old wound. Oh, Jesus Christ, don't get old, son. Yeah, yeah, never get married. Now stop blabbing, you're gonna be fine. I know what I'm doing. This is the key, Jesse. Don't let it out of your sight. It's all we've got. It's in your hands now. We need to stop! Stop?! We need to get the fuck out of here! We need to find a defensive position to hold us over till morning. Then we head to Calico. My wife could blow this defensive position over with a wet fart. We need the higher ground. And that's where the sun will hit first. I'll get the horses, and we'll stand our ground up there.
Lightning? Good thing we still got a big shiny ace up our sleeve. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. I don't think he's breathing. Calico, it's around the corner. There's a doctor there. Call Epsilon. <laughs> Sit down and roll up your sleeve. We will save your father, Mr. Rentier. engineer Virgil Virgil only it's an honor to finally meet you in the flesh <laughs> sir your gauntlet is a thing of beauty only a genius could I need that fixed yesterday I'll need a bigger lab if I'm gonna solve the mysteries of time travel sir I mean how are we doing arrow needs a scapegoat he won't leave without someone to blame for that fiasco Pissed off little Highborn looking for her maker's head? No one could have predicted that. I don't think she did all that for just Abano. We're missing something. I'd bet my last buck we'll heal more from this Felicity tick pretty soon. 
I'm gonna check if Amelia needs some backup with Harrow. Who do I have to bend over this bar and indiscreetly <clears throat> fuck to get some coffee around here? What a day. See you in the briefing room. Need to check on my gauntlet first. There must be a workshop somewhere around. Mr. Rentier, Mr. Harrow wants to see you as soon as you're done. Mr. Harrow is waiting for you in the briefing room, sir. Yeah, yeah, heard that already. Who does he think he is? The heir to the fucking crowd! According... When I got your goddamn gilded invitation, I expected champagne and canapes. Instead, some fang fuck broke into your headquarters and slapped you all around like a gaggle of whimpering sissies. Now the entire country is left unprotected while I stand here with my dick in my hand like an idiot. So again, could someone please tell me how the fuck did this happen? Security services were redirected to protect our most valuable asset. And how the fuck wasn't that me? That was my father's call, and it was Agent Gravener's quick thinking that saved your life, sir. For all the fucking good it'll do once I tell the Capitol that its primary defense against all kinds of monsters just collapsed. We'll take care of it, sir. What, from here? This place is a shithole at the edge of fucking nowhere. And don't be fooled by our humble trapping, Secretary Harrow. Calico Cell has the highest survival rate in the Institute as well as its very best engineer. We are your only chance of turning this around. Then I expect a report on those tick assholes on my desk first thing, Doctor. And who the fuck are you? I, uh, uh, um... <sighs> Wait a minute. I'm the best engineer? You better be, because we need this thing operational as soon as possible, before Harrow comes back to string us all up. Arrow can suck my... How bad is it? Well, the glamour disruptor's fried. Then we have the insulation around the power coupling. Can you fix it or not? It's doable, but I'll need time. A few weeks, a month tops. We ain't got that long. We have to be ready to take down this Felicity character when we find her. You mean if we find them? We have no idea where to even look. Not necessarily. To the north, there's a canyon surrounding the main trail. And the unimaginative locals call it the Devil's Pass. And reports mention possibly unknown vampiric specimens. And we chalked it down to hearsay, but now we sent our top sanguisuge expert to investigate. I hope by expert you mean a field agent and not another bookworm. Scott Bloom co-wrote the Institute's sanguisuge best We need soldiers, not pencil pushers. I can't run around looking for a missing egghead hoping that maybe he brings something to the table. When did he last report? Five days ago. Well, let's just hope he's lost in research. into
Something terribly wrong is happening here. Whoa, let's check this beauty out. This canyon is like some kind of vault. What are they hiding here? Okay. Hope I'll find Bloom in one piece. Shit, 
Whatever is behind that door must be huge. Might be that thing we need to for. Where the heck did it go? Yeah, looks like I'm getting closer. Ugh, what a stench. Thank <laughs> you. 
nothing like anything I've killed before. You down there? Uh, yes, it's it's me. But who are? Uh, whoa, you're Jesse Rennie, sir. Splendiferous. Care to explain what happened here, Bloom? Oh, uh, well, I was sent here to investigate reports of a novel breed of sanguisuge. When I arrived, I encountered a group of familiars. Apparently sent here by their masters. That was a familiar? How come a human turned into that thing so quickly? Well, excellent question, sir. My thesis is that their transformation is linked to the blood from these creatures somehow. The how is what I'm stuck on. Uh, we better take one of those things back with us to the lab. Still beats me what those familiars were doing here. Well, from what I could gather, they were sent on a transport detail, securing a convoy of carts filled with some curious, wriggly little creatures they brought from the Callum sawmill. Uh, we need to check that place out. 